A major day in the baseball world as the league releases the 2020 schedule. The Minnesota Twins open July 24th against the Chicago White Sox, kicking off a schedule that features 40 games against divisional opponents. The Twins are at work in Minneapolis right now as they kicked off their summer camp late last week. They open the 2020 season on the road in Chicago, and while the official season opener is against the White Sox, they'll face the Cubs on July 22nd in an exhibition game at Wrigley Field. The Twins home opener is July 28th against the Cardinals, which will officially open the 60th season of Twins baseball in Minnesota. And good news, all 60 games will be on the radio and 58 of the 60 games will air on Fox Sports North with four TV viewers with the other two to air nationally on Fox. The first weekend of Red Hawks baseball is a wrap and team management says it was a success. Nearly 4,000 fans attended the three consecutive days of baseball, including the largest on Friday with 1,963 fans. General Manager Matt Rao said the feedback from fans was overwhelmingly positive as they adjusted to new seating arrangements and health and safety measures. Rao reports the only change from opening day has been a move to open more gates for exiting the park to help alleviate crowding. The Red Hawks are back in action tomorrow night at Newman Outdoor Field. And the football season just got a little thinner for the region as the North Dakota State College of Science 2020 football season has been canceled. The college's football conference, the Minnesota College Athletic Conference, announced today that it will limit its fall sports to those that have been identified as low risk as it relates to COVID-19. Right now, that means clay target and golf will be the two sports to continue on. While football, volleyball and soccer have been canceled for the 2020 season. And DSCS will also not be able to hold any organized physical activities for any winter sports that typically meet during the fall semester, like basketball and wrestling, baseball and softball. Meanwhile, fingers are still crossed and plans are moving forward for Division I football, including a new ticket method for NDSU fans. NDSU Athletics announced today a transition to mobile tickets for all athletic events beginning this fall with football and volleyball. Mobile tickets offer a quick and convenient method of contactless entry into venues. The university also adds it offers a reduced risk of lost, stolen, or counterfeit tickets. For more information about how this new plan will affect you, we have the full details on our VNL News app. All right, thanks, Beth.